Whilst Dad was out playing with the children... There you go, look! Mum helped me set up the reflection room. This is going to be the reflection room, which is going to be your time out, OK? I call it the reflection room because, you know, it is about the kids reflecting on what they've done. So they start to recognise that you're going to put some very firm boundaries in place. I'm going to ask you to clear the crayon area in a moment okay. because the reflection room is it's a boring room. It means we're here alone, just not doing anything while the rest of the kids are out having fun and playing. OK, I'll clear okay. But before right. we'd even finished, Parker gave her a good reason to use it. <laughs> is it? Before you win this Parker, that is Sophia's toy. You're going downstairs to sit in the reflection room. Do you hear me? Don't, and you don't hit. Don't kick, don't kick. You have to stay in here for five minutes because you did not ask Sophia if you could take her toy. And then once she wanted it back, you threw it. Parker, stop. Come out. Just getting Parker into the room took a lot out of Mum. And I didn't really know whether she would follow through with discipline. So I took her aside to talk to her. And that's when she broke down. Inside, I can see. I can see how emotional you are inside. Right? I can see that inside you. You can get tough and you're going to deal with these kids. You know why? Because these kids are going to carry on like that and walk over you. And I know that you've got that mental strength to deal with that. They're going to find respect for you. You know why? Because you are a loving mother. You are a mother who wants to do best by your kids. I do. After the talk, she got an apology from Parker. She'd done it. Parker, I need an apology. Mm. Money. But it wasn't long before Parker would start all over again. Mommy gave you a warning, and you're continuing to disrupt the game. This time I suggested that Parker do his time out in the kitchen so that Mum could keep an eye on the kids in the backyard. That boy pulled every trick out of his hat to push Mum's buttons. Um, just take him back to the door and he's five minutes have to start all over again. Take back. He definitely wanted to get my attention. He definitely wanted me to respond to him. Ignoring Parker when he is in that zone and in the timeout, it, that's very hard. It's very frustrating. The other kids came inside and that's when Mum decided to put Parker back into the reflection room and he went absolutely mad. <laughs> Parker was so mad that he became very destructive and started to tear up everything in that room. It seemed like it took forever. And it was exhausting. But I knew I had to stick with it because I can outdo them. They're not going to get the better of me. <laughs> Parker, can you apologize to Mommy? Sorry. Mum's going to have more challenges like this, but if she remains consistent, then the kids are going to realize pretty quickly she means business.